Sales here from Nyad Irrigation Systems in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Today we're going to do a pressure and flow test so that we can properly design an underground sprinkler system. First off, you want to make something like this. We have a connection so that we can hook this up to a garden tap, a couple pressure gauges, a ball valve, a hose, and a five gallon pail. What we're going to do first is we're going to hook this up to the garden tap. Once that's on the garden tap, we're going to ensure the ball valve is off, turn on the water, make sure this is all the way on along with the water service inside the house. Document the static pressure as 60 PSI. Then we're going to do a flow test at 40 PSI dynamic pressure because that is the optimum operating pressure for the sprinklers we are using. To get to the dynamic pressure, I will open this ball valve to get to 40 PSI. Once I'm at 40 PSI, I will put the hose in the five gallon pail and time to see how long it takes to fill the five gallon pail. If it takes one minute to fill a five gallon pail, you have five gallons a minute. If it takes two minutes, you have two and a half gallons a minute and so forth. The key point is when you're doing a flow test, you got to do it at the proper dynamic pressure. So if you're using heads that need 40 PSI, lower the pressure to 40 PSI before you start doing the flow test. Thank you for your time. Have a wonderful day. Bye for now.